The Jeep Gladiator is a great truck that combines the usefulness of a pickup with the go anywhere capability of a Wrangler. One of the engines available that a handful of folks enjoyed is the Eco Diesel option. The torque on tap is a nice thing to have on the trail. But if you were thinking of picking one up, you'd better hurry because Jeep is about to dole out its final batch of diesel drinking Gladiator trucks. The Eco Diesel is going away. Jeep is focusing on its push to more electrified options moving forward. Rather than let the diesel go clattering into that good night, Jeep is offering up a final limited run of Gladiators as a way to say goodbye. And you know, to basically print money since people with dough love the last of things. It's called the 2023 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon Far Out. I'm not sure why Far Out is done up as one word, but that's not important. What is important is the engine being celebrated. It's the three liter turbo diesel that produces 260 horsepower, which doesn't sound that wild, but the 442 pound feet of torque, however, does sound pretty great. Plus that torque peaks as low as 1400 RPM. Since this is a Gladiator Rubicon, it also gets Dana 44 axles front and rear, 373 rear gearing and a four to one low range ratio. As for the far out bits, this truck also wears a diesel three liter graphic on the hood, far out badging on the tailgate, 17 inch polished black wheels and red accents against black leather on the inside, which I would show you if Jeep supplied more than one photo. At the corners, you have a set of 33 inch mud terrain tires while the front bumper is steel. The fender flares are body colored and you get the Mopar spray and bed liner, LED lighting and all weather floor mats. It's a pretty loaded Gladiator Rubicon at this point, so it should come as no surprise that the asking price is sitting above the tree line on into the clouds. The package itself adds $12,100 to the bottom line, which is how we arrive at the MSRP of $71,790. You know, if you go to Jeep's website right now, they're running a deal on the Gladiator, and I built a diesel Rubicon with a few options. Not all the ones on this limited far out version, but the tires, a color matched hardtop, stuff like that. And I landed at just over 60K with the current discount. So maybe the price of this limited run truck is what's far out. Regardless, it is limited and that could pique the interest of some Jeep faithful. The automaker plans to build just 1,000 examples. If you wanna spend over 70K on a diesel Jeep truck, the order books are open now through the end of September. And then Jeep plans to begin deliveries in the third quarter of 2023. This means the trucks are ready to go basically and Jeep is ready to start counting all of that cash folks are gonna spend on these things. Really though, at over 70K, Jeep should be giving us the Mojave 392 I keep daydreaming about. Though in reality, that would be a $100,000 truck, which is just silly, right?